How are you, Sandra? My name is Chris McLeod. I'm a comedian and poet from Red Car near Middlesbrough in Teesside. And um, I got a call today asking if I would read one of your poems. And, um, and I've agreed to do that, but I've written you a poem. Uh, I had a quick look on your website and stuff, and I've had a look at your Facebook page. And even though I've never met you, I like you. So I've written this for you. I was going to come down to Liverpool to your hospice and read it outside the window, but they said I couldn't do it. Uh, thought it might cheat you up. Anyway, I've written it now, and I'm going to read you it. This one's for you. Send me your poem, and uh, and I'll read it for you. And I'll help you raise some money, all right? And I'll give you a page mention on my Facebook page, because I have uh, about 5,000 people following me on one page, so we'll see if we can get you some money raised, eh? So yeah, I call this poem <clears throat> The Stranger I've Always Known and this is for you, alright? In the rising of the sun this world will hear your words each new line that's fresh begun will make the song of birds your rhymes will blow among the daisies and ripple in the streams they'll bring peace and love eternal and light that shines and gleams your prose will fill the hearts of other people who've been kissed by cancer's curse and every vowel and consonant will echo to your verse. Your inner strength and inner humour will become the weakened shield to help beat each and every tumour to which most fall and yield. Your words will become the words of heroes, the armour of the brave, your rhymes and lines will bring hope to the lost, the precious gift of life they'll save. I've never ever met you. Before today, I'd never heard the name of you, this most courageous scouser poet who deserves her literary fame. But as soon as I saw you, I liked you. I loved your self-deprecation and your wit, that magnetic Liverpoolian attitude that showed you couldn't give a shit about tumours knocking at your door. From you, they weren't going to get an answer. You just carried on laughing at yourself. That's the way, lass, the way to beat the cancer. So send me your poem, my poetic sister-in-arms, and to do it justice, I will try. I'll feel the words you give to me, and I'll give them wings and make them fly. I'll give them all my heart and soul. And from Middlesbrough to Liverpool, I'll say, you'll never walk alone. Because among true poets like us, though we've never met, you're the stranger I've always known. That's for you, Sand. Send me a poem, and I'll get it recorded and sent back. And I'll put a link to your charity on my page. God bless you, lass. Keep smiling, keep peace in your heart. God bless you and love you. Ta-da.